Hey, what's going on everybody? Paul Tech here. So recently I've been getting asked this question on my ZTE Z Max Pro. Uh, how exactly did you change the theme and choose your own image in the keyboard here? So it's actually quite simple. I'll walk you through the process. Again, there is no uh, downloaded custom keyboard to my ZTE Z Max Pro. This is just the stock keyboard on the Z Max. So I'm gonna go ahead and walk you through that process and just show you one more time how you can customize your keyboard and pick your own image that you'd like to have on your keyboard here. On your messaging app, what you want to do is type message and then right next to that emoji right there, you want to hold on, you're going to press down and slide up to that settings option there. Okay, so when you get into that settings, again one more time, hold down, slide up and you're going to choose Google keyboard settings, so we're going to choose that. Next, what you want to do is choose theme, and then when you get into this area right here, click my image. Now you can use your gallery, Zedg, or photos. For me, I have Zedge because I've downloaded that, but I'm going to go ahead and use gallery just once. Wallpapers. Now right here is where you can choose whatever um, wallpaper you'd like. So for instance, I'll choose this one here. You can crop it, um, pinch to scale, drag to move. So I'll just click that, click next, done. Let's go back. Now type message, and now it has changed into that image that I chosen. So it's pretty simple, just remember right there, slide up to settings, Google keyboard settings, click on theme. Of course you have all these other options here, but if you want to choose your own image, click my image, choose whichever one you want from the gallery from your photos. Um, I'm going to choose gallery, again um, wallpapers, and then click on whichever one you want, pinch to scale, drag to move, click next, and when you're happy with it, um, you can adjust bright brightness there as well, click done, go back, go back. And then type message and bam, it changed it right there for you. So hopefully this helps you out in figuring out how you can customize your keyboard, um, choosing your own image to have on your keyboard there. Um, if it did, hit that thumbs up button. Really do appreciate it. And if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe for more future videos. And this is Paul Tech, and I'll talk to you on the next one. Bye.